Hi guys, this is Oscar with another quick video on how to get started on your website. This is a this is specifically for the website I built for you for free, but you can use it pretty much for any WordPress website. So I hope you find it useful. And we're going to cover how to log in for the first time. Your website may look different than this, but once you have a WordPress website, you have the ability to log in. You should have been given a username and a password. So go find that, and on your website. You will look for a, a um, section called Meta, just like you see here, and under that you will see Login, Entries, RSS, Comments, comments RSS, WordPress.org. If you click on Login, you will be taken to the page where you can log in, enter your username and your password, and you will be in. However, sometimes you don't have this on your theme. It's very much uh, dependent on the theme and whether it was put onto the widgets area. If you don't have this, you have to remember what the website login address is. But I have one trick. Anytime you need to log in to the um, dashboard, which is the main management area for your WordPress website, you can go into the domain at the very top, add a slash, and then type in wp-admin. This will re this will send you to the login page every single time, unless you are logged in. And if you are logged in, then you will be in the dashboard. So let's take a look. wp-admin that will take me to the login page where then I can enter my username and my password. In this case, in this case, I will use my LastPass and enter my username automatically and log in. If you lost your password, if you don't know what your username is, ask the person that set up your website for you or click on the lost password link, enter your email address and WordPress will send you a new password. Once you're logged in, then you're free to do whatever you wish. You can um, update themes, create new posts, and do whatever you need. To log out of your WordPress website, which you, which you should do whenever you finish working on it, on the top right corner, you will see a username that says um, howdy, and then your username, or, or a, a plugin that's uh, wording that will say howdy, and then your username. Down at the bottom, you can click log out. That will take you back to the to the login screen, and now you're ready to uh, go on about your business and do other things. Notice here is the lost password, and here is um, if you click on back to the name of your site, you will be taken back to the home page. Now, if for some reason you cannot find this section here, I already show you how to log in without it. But if you want to put it back because maybe you removed it by mistake or you thought you didn't want it and now you want it back, I will show you how to add that very simple log on to your website that's what we're going to do right now once you log in you will go to appearances and widgets so appearance and widgets and you will add the meta box which is a standard widget by WordPress into whatever widget area you wish so you will find it right here meta you can drag and drop and place it wherever you wish. For example, we'll put it right here. We save this and we go look back at the main page. You will see that now we have it in two places, at the very top and at the very bottom. So don't forget to log out when you finish. And that is it for this video. Very simple, how to log in and log out to your website. If you have any other questions, let me know or watch more videos. I teach you uh, how to do the different things in WordPress. And if you don't have a free WordPress website yet, visit my free WordPress website at notagarage.com. Have a nice day.